The betting firm William Hill has been handed a record fine for social responsibility failures and not for the first time. Uh, Shaman has more for us now. And Shaman, it's a whopper. It is a whopper. It's actually the biggest uh, settlement that they will have to pay in the Gambling's Commission history. It's for two reasons. It's for breaching anti-money laundering laws, so laws that prohibit criminals, really, being able to wash their dirty money using gambling companies and for breaching social responsibility laws as well. And this is uh, because many customers were able to gamble huge amounts of money in really short amounts of time. One example is that a customer... Was was, uh, was able to open a new account and spend £23,000 in 20 minutes, Kate. Oh, it's it. astonishing. And another customer was able to spend around £32,000 in just a couple of days, all of this without any checks. And what's quite interesting, actually, is that the gambling commissioner said it could have been a lot worse. The repercussions could have been a lot worse. Andrew Rhodes said that, actually, when investigating the failings, they'd seriously considered whether or not to revoke William Hill's licence because of these breaches. Really? Wow. Yeah, but he continued saying that because the operator immediately recognised their failings and worked with us, uh, they did instead to opt uh, for the largest enforcement in their history. And of course, like you said, it isn't the first time they were fined in 2018, but I believe that was only for around £6 million. So this is a substantially... And this yeah. is the hot on the heels of two gambling firms last yes, week Yes, yes, well. just last week. And we have actually had a statement from uh, the companies that own William Hill as well. Uh, they said, uh, the spokesperson is for 888, that's the company that owns William Hill, that says the settlement relates to a period when William Hill was under previous ownership and management. After William Hill was acquired, the company quickly addressed uh, the identified issues with the implementation of a rigorous action plan. OK, for now. Thanks very much indeed. Thanks a lot. Talking about, of course, there are charities uh, like Gambling Aware that can help you if you are addicted to uh, gambling. Check those out on our website if you feel the need.